Today I'm going to talk about graphene solid state battery and I'm lucky enough to have one of these graphene solid state batteries so uh, today I'm going to do some tests on it and then I'm going to tear it down and I'm going to cut it out and show you what's inside. Let's get started. Right so let's first talk about graphene. It's a single layer of carbon in hexagonal shape and it's one atom thick and it is one of the best electrical and heat conductor at room temperature and that's the reason why we use this in batteries now let's take a look at this battery it's about the same size as an 18650 maybe a little bit bigger but it packs a punch because it's a solid state battery so let's check on the voltage of the battery 53 volts and uh, at full charge it's about 54.6 volts and because there's no charger they can charge up to 54 volts I have to use one of these to charge the battery it's a boost controller so it boosts the voltage from a lower DC to higher DC voltage so I can charge this battery and because we got 53 volts on one single cell I'm gonna use one single cell to power my e-bike this bike is 48 volts and it should be able to power my e-bike so let's plug it in wow you see the spark what happens every time when I first plug in the battery now let's double check again on the battery voltage just gonna measure it right at the terminals here got 53 volts here we go. Now let's try and turn on the bike to see if it turn on. There we go. Full charge. And let's see if it works. Whoops. It works. That's amazing. Time to go for a test drive. I've tied it down with a bungee cord so it doesn't move around too much. I'm gonna hurry because uh, it's gonna get dark pretty soon here. So next, I'm going to cut it up and show you what's inside this battery. So it's got a very thick layer of insulation, like a plastic rubberized insulation on the outside. Let's cut it out, see what's inside. Use my scissor, easier. Wow, it's double layer. That's very nice. So it's got a plastic layer on the outside and a paper layer on the inside. So it's double insulation. So paper is a very good insulator, right? So that's why I guess that's why they use paper. It makes sense because this battery is over 50 volts, so you need more insulation, right? So let's peel this out and uh, see what's more we got inside the battery. It's tightly wrapped here. Nice. Well, this guy looks familiar. I think I've seen him somewhere. Just can't remember. And uh, so we got 100. I think this is the model number of the battery. And uh, even got a serial number. 
I think this is the serial number of the battery and that's the model number cool so double insulation so next I'm gonna use my Dremel tool I'm gonna cut it out I'm gonna show you what's inside this battery so here is the inside for the battery this is the top part of the battery and I have to really cut it apart because it's got a very thick metal case you see there and inside we got long rods of carbon graphene in long rods that's amazing this reminds me of the uh, uranium core where they have a long tube and then inside that tube they put pellets of uranium and this is probably the same technology here it's just that we got graphene which is really really small packed inside this long rod here this is amazing technology there's nothing inside but graphene and that's all I have for now folks I hope you have a great day on April Fool and thanks for watching I will see you next time